Hey there, I'm Ashley Rowe from 7 Eyewitness News. We're taking you through the 716 in two minutes. We're learning more about the young couple killed in a Valentine's Day crash in the North Towns. 21-year-old Gianna Ameno and her boyfriend, 21-year-old Tyler Lichtenberger, were killed in that six-car pileup in the town of Tonawanda. It happened at Sheridan and Military on Friday night. Police say the couple was involved in a minor accident in Buffalo and Military and Skillen minutes before. The couple leave behind a toddler son. Is Delaware North getting political in the race for New York's 27th Congressional District? The company has put Vice President of Development Nate McMurray on unpaid administrative leave while he runs on the Democratic ticket in the special election. It just so happens that McMurray's opponent in the race is Republican Chris Jacobs, whose relatives own Delaware North. Jacobs insists he has nothing to do with the company's decision to put McMurray on leave. Now let's check in with Autumn Lewandowski and a bit of a messy Tuesday ahead. We are going to deal with a lot of different types of precipitation and the wind is about to increase as well. Taking a look at things hour by hour, what we're going to find are temperatures rising into the 40s. But before we get there, we're going to start with snow showers and temperatures in the 30s. Notice the winds will be increasing as well throughout the overnight and into our Tuesday. So here it goes hour by hour that windy uh, conditions. They'll come in as we get into that morning drive around an inch or less for the Niagara frontier, much less for Buffalo and right along the lake shore and a couple of inches for the southern tier are possible by Tuesday morning. However, it does all end up turning to rain and we'll deal with those rain showers into Tuesday afternoon, but the winds will still stay breezy on that ride home. Take a look at them gusting to around 40 miles an hour by 7 a.m. and continuing that trend to about noon and then finally subsiding little by little through 5 o'clock.